Hello, welcome back to KMS Weekly News. I'm Carmen. And I'm Jack, and today's date is February 9th, 2018, and let's get straight into the news. Responsible when no one is looking is when it counts. So help out and pick up trash or recyclables and place them where they belong. Take pride in your school and be responsible. We take pride. Ours stands for responsibility, and this is what responsibility looks like. My name is Jack, I'm here with Ms. Vasquez, Kennedy Middle School Yearbook Advisor, and I'll be asking you a few questions today. So, when do the 8th graders start the voting for best nomination? Uh, we're going to start with the nominations uh, the last week of February, and that's going to be only for 8th graders. So, when do the 8th graders start their voting for the best nomination? It's going to start the last week of February, and that's only for 8th graders. All 8th grade advisory teachers will receive uh, the voting slips, and you guys will be able to turn them in in front of room 10 during lunch. Some of the categories will include best smile, best eyes, best athlete, and so on. When is the last day that students can order their email? So for the price of $25, um, students can pre-order the yearbooks all the way up, up until the last week of April. After April, the yearbooks are going to start full. They're going to be priced for $28. Final question. When are the yearbooks coming in so students may pick them up? The yearbooks are going to get here probably before the last week of, um, the first week of June, sorry, and they're going to be ready for you to pick up probably two to three days before school is over. We're going to make an announcement. Carmen and I'm here with 7th grade basketball coach Mr. Becca and I'm here to ask you a few questions. So tell me, how do you feel about being a 7th grade basketball coach? Uh, well, I'm fortunate enough to have a good group of students this year. Um, you know, they are 7th graders, so um, pretty much you know, teaching them from the ground up. A lot of these kids, this is their first year playing. Um, but it's fun, it's enjoyable. It tests my patience, but I like it. Okay, another thing is how do you feel about the winning of uh, Frank? Well, I feel great about it. You know, um, I definitely think this team deserved that win. Um, it was the first one of the season. It, I mean, it came a little bit late in the year, but uh, I knew it was going to come eventually. You know, I had faith in our guys, and um, you know, better, better late than ever. Also, how do you feel about the Um, I feel good. You know, you got to go into every game, you know, believing. That What special event will be happening next week? Well, we're going to be having the Hollywood Stars dance on February 13th from 2.45 to 4.45. And what do you mean about Hollywood Stars? Well, at this dance, students can dress up as celebrities as long as they keep it uh, within the dress code. They are certainly welcome to bring their outfits to school and wear it to the dance, or they can come dress as themselves as fans. So it's a unique opportunity to show your creativity, and we're also going to be having some special events at the dance. Can you give us a little sneak peek on what will be happening next week? Yes, sure. We're going to have a red carpet, so students who dress up as celebrities can walk down the red carpet. They'll have opportunity for photos, and we're also going to have a contest. Kennedy students will be eligible to win their own Oscar at the dance. We'll have um, Oscars for those who are dressed the best, who have the best costume, who have the best hair, the best group. So we're really excited for this upcoming event. It's the first time we do a, a Hollywood theme for the dance. Well, thank you for your time. All right, we'll see you guys next week at the dance. We've come to an end of KMS Weekly News. Until next time.